1938 semifinal. We're looking at Nick Robo Crestwood versus defending state champ Nate Hagen. Hagen going to Edinburgh for Tim Flynn and the Fighting Scots. Robo 45 and 0 with his back to in the red ankle bands. Taking on defending champ, so another great semifinal here. This is 138 pounds, Division II Ohio. Semi-final. Shot by Hagen. Roble. Hagen, nice little duck attempt. Hagen, Roble on the edge there. Nick Roble of Crestwood. Nate Hagen, Toledo Central Catholic in the red and the green. Roble in the red ankle band. So, this one should fit the hype as far as I'm concerned. Hagen, 45 and 5. Roble, 5, 45 and 0. Oh. Zero, that is. Exchanging tax here on the edge. Robo keeping that wrist. Hagen underneath. And watch that little duck. Watch that little duck. Not much happening here. And we're gonna be off the mat. We're gonna restart. 19 seconds left in the first. Semi-final best round of wrestling here in Ohio, in my opinion. At the Ohio State Championship. End of the period, going to the disc club, scoreless. It is going to be Hagen's choice. We'll be looking over here at the coaches, see what they got to say. forward. Robel says, I'm not going to mess with it. Let's him go. 1-0 lead Hagen Central Cap. And talking to Hagen, he's had a heck of a season. There is a warning on Robel as Hagen's pushing pace. And Hagen said today he wrestled scrap talk like three times this season. And I believe he wrestled Dominic Demas as well, so this guy's battle-tested. He's earned the 45-5 and five record. Wins and the losses. Hagen pushing with that two-on-one now. Takes a half shot there. Nice shot there by Robo shoots him off. 106 left in the second period. 10 lead Hagen. So Robo putting the undefeated record on the line here. Versus defending state champion. Nate Hagen of Toledo Central Catholic. 48 seconds left in the second period. for stalling. I don't know if I agree with that. I don't know if he's really been stalling. He's been a little less active, but not stalling, I wouldn't say. Hagen tries to knee slide in there. Nothing doing with it. And 31 seconds left in the second. One to lead Hagen. Stall warning on Robo. And it is going to be third period. 1-0 lead Hagen. Robles' choice. 
a shot. Robo has been dinged, so he's got to be careful. Now Hagen really picking his tempo up. And you can see if he has another series like that, they will ding Robo. They will ding him for stalling. He's got to stay in there and fight the fight. Now Hagen really starting to put his tempo to another level. He's going up a gear. Unless he gets another, uh, gotta fire off another shot. Or if he gets shot off or pushed off, you're probably gonna see a stall call. He's tipped on the edge. Oh, there's a little double knee drop, and luckily for Robo, he's able to shoot him off. Robo's gotta pick his tempo up like Hagen has done. Hagen, a little half shot. Stall call. Shot. There's the stall warning and a point. So 42 seconds off 2 1 lead Hagen. He has been substantially more active. Not substantially, just more active. And he loves that little peek out. Knee slide, double knee slide in there. I like it. Robo goes low single attempt. And now Robo pushing tempo. And Hagen got dinged in the eye there. 22 seconds a 2 1 lead. Robo needs a takedown. With a stall call to give now. And they're not going to call that. I can't believe it. Shot by Robel. Hagen backing out. Five seconds. And can Robel get him dinged again or get a takedown? We'll see here. Five seconds. Hagen does not have another stall to give. Robel in on a shot. Hagen going to the finals. Future fighting Scott Hagen with the win. 